this uh I'm gonna get this thing going because I gotta leave at 1.30 to go to the dentist. So um, I'm doing this video because we got these new um, Carrera lap counters, Carrera Go lap counters, okay? And um, now they're not designed for HO at all, okay? I just want everybody to know. But, you know, a lot of people have been asking me for lap counters and, and there's other companies that make four or six leaners. Um, and this is just a very simple, uh, you know, uh, lap counter. You know, you basically can, uh, let's just start it from the beginning. Now, I haven't gone through all the different features of it, but, you know, you can change the uh, amount of laps. Uh, you know, you can go, um, you know, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 hundred ten laps. So we're going to do 10 lap or we're going to do this together. So I'm going to screw up without reading the rules. I'm not going to read the rules. <laughs> I don't have to because I don't want to. Okay. So we're going to do 10 laps. Oh, let's go back to 10. All right. Then we set it. Uh, we got that already. Then now, so it's now it's all set, ready for racing. Let's get a car here. And then you press, now, so this is an HO. Now, this is as, as narrow as it gets. But the, if you put this right in the center, okay, it registers both cars perfectly. Okay, hi there. Hi, James Murray. How we doing? Okay, so we're going to do this together. Okay, then we set the race. Goes through four, three, two, one. I got to have it on the right track. See that? Look at that. Just it just registered. Okay, uh, three minutes or three seconds and fifty-four. Three minutes or three seconds and thirty-five. Three minutes and twenty-nine or three seconds. Three seconds. So we're still three seconds. Three seconds. Two nine nine. Okay, let's see how fast I can. Two nine eight. Let's see. Come on, let's go. Two nine two eight three. Come on. Two seven five. Let's see, let's see before I crash. Two six eight, and so two six eight winner. So that's the winner. Okay. Now, I'm not, I'm not saying that, yes, it works both lanes. Watch. Okay, so let's start again. Okay. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we don't want to do that car. We want to do this car. See that? It registers just that car. Well, that car wants to fly off. Okay, it registers only that car. And, and notice it does not register over here because the sensor only registers a certain distance, it looks like. So let's try it with both of them. But it's not registering the other lane, so there's no way that it can be registering the lane. Nice. I thought HO lanes might be too narrow. Look, looks good. Yes, it look it it. Yeah, and listen, I'm not saying that it's it's designed for HO, but you know, you could if you sat if you set this up right between your track and then put a little bit of cardboard or maybe uh, cut some wood or maybe even a piece of track like a three inch track that you have and you could cut that amount of track and just set that right where you want your lap counting to be. There, you've got a lap counter for two lanes. Now, this is not a four-lane lap counter. I want to make that uh, make that very clear. It's not four lanes. It's two lanes. Okay. Um, let me um, let me check something here. Um, uh, and so, um, the problem with these manuals is they have to have every look at that every language on the planet. Okay, in these things. So this is basically. Let's go all the way up to English, Inglo, 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 France, Great Britain, Great Britain in the U.S. There we go. Oh, God save the king. La, 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 la. Race information false. 
Yeah, so this is a two-lane, two-lane, um, two-laner. Denmark. Why do they have all of these? And it's battery operated. Okay, so you don't need any other. You know, I did, they're ninety nine dollars. You know, I thought, you know what? Uh, I I wanted to show you guys because someone asked me, does this work with uh, with the HO? And it does. You know, so it does. Um, it does. Um, count the lap so excuse me if you wanted to get one of these and set it up on your lap or on your track you can at least have a okay so i'm gonna hit everything yeah aren't i unbelievable and you're you'll you'll have uh uh you'll have a lap counter that would would tell what your laps are and who's the winner um of the race now, that being said, I just sent a video of, of this track. I was demoing it. I just sent a video to Craig at Auto World. And I told Craig, I said, this is what you need to make, and it needs to come out by Christmas. I don't care what you have to do. You have to have this come out by Christmas. There's no reason why you can't pull all the stops out and have something like this come out by Christmas. Because I, I, I'd sell 100 of these things, maybe even 200 of these things. Anyways, I wanted to do a quick video on this. This is item number 0, uh, 20, uh, 207 1590. I think I had the wrong number on the, on the live stream. I'll change that later. Uh, but it's very easy. You just put in the batteries. And obviously, it's for Carrera Go, okay? And, um, um, and so it, this is as close as it goes, okay? So... Um, but it works fine. You could change this. You could put uh, you could put AFX on it if you wanted to. Uh, and it's very simple. Th there are th three buttons. Okay. I mean, it's not complicated. That's the problem. They want to complicate a lap counter. A lap counter just you want electronic, so it counts counts the laps. Okay. And uh, uh, I, I told Craig, just take this thing, copy this, and put it on your track. Make it narrower or have it you know designed differently. But this is perfect for uh, lap counting. Of course, if I can keep my Bel Air on the track, which I can't, that's one of my exclusives, Bel Airs. Now it stopped. Oh, come on. Oh, you got to be kidding. Where is the other Bel Air for the... I don't know where the other car is. Let's try this one here. And all you have to do is push the button again, go through all the sequences, and boom, it's all ready to go. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Oh, he jumped the gun. Why does everybody call me when I'm doing a live stream? Brian Young. you a set we're gonna knock a hundred dollars off of, uh, that four lane set for you so if all you have to do is call my son Ryan back at the store and tell him you want to get that victory 400 and your and and tell him your dad said it's uh, at that special price 
hey, no problem, anytime. And thank you very much for uh, for uh, 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 thinking about us. Uh, we appreciate that. Well, I'm doing a live stream right now, my friend. <laughs> All right. Yeah, just call him and, and he'll take care of everything, okay? Yeah. All right, that's the guy with the brain tumor. We're going to give him a special on a set. All right, so... Um, we jumped the gun there, I think. What did I do here? Ten lanes. Oh, I know why. This thing has to be right in the middle. Okay, that's what happened. All right, all right, so I did not have this set. It has to be just right for each car to be, this sensor must be just set because the sensors are right here. They're right there. And so, see how that, when I touch that, you hear that boop, beep sound? I mean, this is a pretty sensitive, and so you can't have it this way. Of course, then this one's not gonna register. So you have to get it to the right distance has to be perfect right in the distance so it's going to register that car see see the car is registering that's why it wasn't working oh darn it okay so let's start this again all right five four three two one go oh come on <laughs> i can't handle it i i just want to sometimes scream bloody murder uh, did you go over the price with the brain surgery? Yes, I did. See that? Okay, so that's the video. Uh, there's not a big video today. Uh, I just uh, wanted to show you. I think this is cool. I think everybody, if you want to try a lap counter for your four or two lane layout, this is the perfect one to get for right now. I mean, unless you want to wait a year. Uh, of course, it has a nice little plastic. I'm going to leave that on because this is still for sale. Um, um, of course, if you buy this one, you'll get free batteries because I'm just going to leave the batteries in it. Uh, and so you're going to put that right in the middle of the layout. And um, this is item number 2007-1590. 2007-1590. And it's the Carrera Go, Carrera Go lap counter. Carrera Go lap counter. I think I'm going to sell 100 of these things. Uh, because they're the only ones that have a lap counter on the market. See, the thing about this is all this stuff is made in, in, see, the Carrera is in the same factory that Auto World. And Auto World could technically go to that warehouse and say, hey, we want some of these components into our lap counter. <laughs> uh, anyway. And so, if you are uh, uh, if you are begging for a lap counter, uh, this is the one to get for your HO track. It works fine. It works just fine. It counts all the laps. Holy oh, crashed! Holy cow! Hey, yeah, yeah, what they doing? I am working on Saturday. Yes, I will be at the store on Saturday. I am working on the law. I am working all day. I am working all day. I, I might make an appearance. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you will, Adam. 
Oh my gosh, why does it keep crashing? Uh oh. Anyway, guys, that is the video. Now, I want to say something else because I just have to talk about this thing. So if you want to buy the greatest printer that you ever want to buy and not spend a lot of money on ink, there's only one printer to buy, and that is the Epson Ecotech print printers. And here is why an Ecotech printer is so cheap. I am doing a Bible study on Sunday now, and uh, it's basically... And this is called uh, Verse by Verse by William Newell. Newell. And this book of his, I have to print it. It's 444 pages, okay? So I've got to print one for each of the, my. Uh, I have 15 people that are in my class. And so right here is 1,500 pages, okay? I've hardly used any ink. And the ink is so cheap, you get it in containers like this that last literally forever. Matter of fact, here is my opinion about the Ecotech printers. They are so good, the printer will wear out faster than the ink. <laughs> Do you hear what I said? Do you hear what I said? The printer will wear out faster than the ink. And that's what happened to my very first one. I literally use that. That's when we started doing this in 2015. Tim and I, we did all these colors and, and all these little designs. I must admit it printed a thousand, thousands of colored uh, images. I literally wore that printer out. I didn't want to throw it away, but I had to because the cartridge was just shot. We, we printed so much stuff on it. Um, now this is the Ecotech 3760. You can get these at Sam's Club for, I think the cheapest Ecotech at Sam's Club, it's like, $2.99. Best $2.99 you'll ever buy. You will never, I, I repeat, and this is a, a, a promo for Ecotech. Because because you know they got Shaq, but he doesn't do he doesn't do it any good. I could sell a million of these if they put me on television. Anyway, the Ecotech printer is by far the greatest printer ever made. And here is why. The cartridges. There are no cartridges. All you have is ink, and you get you get all the colors when you buy it. You get all four colors, and that's enough to print thousands of copies. You'll print color copies like you never thought you would print, and it costs a dime or not even a penny. Okay, so here's, here's the deal. I was going to get these printed from a printer, okay, and they wanted three cents a piece. Well, to print these, it was going to cost me 300 bucks. I said... I'll just go buy some more paper. So I bought a whole re a whole whole thing of paper, and I'm gonna print. I've already I've already printed four of them. <laughs> Look at it. Now it takes about 20 minutes to print each one. So I've got three printed right now. I'm in the process of getting the fourth one printed. Uh, let's see. Make a video about it, Bob. Let's see. Uh, why, why are you going to the dentist? Okay, well, here's the reason I see Adam likes to get all the details. Well, for one thing, my dentures, I have not had them refitted in the last two months. So all through Christmas, all of January and all of most November, they've been pretty good, but they are getting a little loose. So they, there's basically, they, 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 they basically, uh, um, drill away uh, some of the, the rubbery stuff and then they squirt the rubbery stuff on my mouth again because my mouth is shrinking. And so, so it has to be refitted basically. And that's a good dentist. You want a good dentist that wants to do that. Uh, I will work on it. Let's see, I will work on it. Let's see, uh, yeah, but, okay. Uh, Yeah, the only problem with this lap counter, it won't work on the Victory 400, okay? Now, I've already told Auto World to make one of these four lanes. It needs to be from two to four lanes. Boom, you got it. From this end, uh, it's not shrinking, LOL. Uh, LOL, Adam, boy, you guys just like to make fun of me, don't you? 
Yeah, unfortunately, this lap counter, that's why you're going to need one of these for the Victory 400s. And you can get these online, uh, this unit right here. And that is, uh, um, I can't think of the name. of Oh, Trackmate. It's called Trackmate. Trackmateracing.com. And that's, that will go four lanes, six lanes, and that's what you should buy for your, your permanent layout, okay, is track made, okay? But if you just have a two-lane layout in your house and you just want to have fun with two cars, get one of these Carrera Go lap counters right here, guys. This is what you need to get right now. All right, I've got to, uh, this is, I told you this was going to be a quickie, a quickie video. Um, I just got in my drones. I got nine more drones in. What we're gonna have? We're having a uh, we're having a youth organ a youth thing at church, and I thought, you know what? I'm gonna get a bunch of drones and have the kids fly all these drones. <laughs> and so <laughs> I'm gonna take another one apart and put it on my truck. I got to get my truck. My um, the problem is I burn out the other drones circuit, so I'm gonna put it mount it right here on that truck. All right, guys, we will see you later. Uh, and you guys have a great evening, and we'll see you tomorrow morning and tomorrow at 9, 7 to 8. And uh, I got to tell Ryan about auction too, okay? So we'll see you later.